Welcome. My name is Tony Aguiar with ACP. I'm here at the Primrose Gathering Place, and today I would like to show you how to do rice in the Amana RC30 microwave oven. It's a fairly basic process. <clears throat> Over here I have some rice. I have four cups of rice and eight cups of water. Um, actually, I added about a half a cup more because when you're cooking with a microwave oven with this kind of energy, you really want to add a little bit more water just because of the evaporation is so great in, uh, in that process. So I have eight and a half cups of water. And typically, depending on the, the recipe amount that you're doing, you can use a two, one, two to one ratio like you normally would for your recipe. Just add a little bit more water to, to prevent any uh, over evaporation. So as you can see here, I have no lid on this pan. It's important that you do not use a lid, otherwise it will foam and bubble over. Now, I'm going to program the settings into the oven. I'm putting my, my pan of rice in the oven. I'm going to press the icon that looks like a, a book, and I'm going to program it into keypad number one. Now, I'm going to put in my time on stage one. We're going to do this in two stages. I'm going to do five minutes. On stage one at 100%, I'm going to go to stage two, and I'm going to do five minutes also. And I'm going to do that at 60%. And if you saw, I just pressed the icon that, with the triangle with the lines going through it for the microwave, and I put in 60%. I program, I hit the icon that looks like a book to save that. And now I'm all set to go. All I want to do now is press number one for that program. You see the total time is 10 minutes. And if you remember, we just programmed two stages, five minutes each. Five minutes at 100%, five minutes at 60%. Total time was 10 minutes, and that's what the countdown is from. As you can see, the timer has gone off. The rice should be ready. And you know what? It is. As you can see, the rice, is some nice steam coming out of there. It's nice and loose. Great product. And one of the things that you should do now that it's out of the microwave oven is just put a lid on it just like you would at home and what that does is if there's any moisture left in in the pan it's going to help absorb um, the rice is going to absorb any of that moisture back back in uh, and it's going to keep it nice and loose the way it is now that you saw how easy that is to make rice in in a microwave oven have fun cooking <laughs>